Hey, what's up guys? This is DMF Snipes bringing you a Minecraft tutorial on how to make a TNT cannon. This cannon works 95% of the time and it shoots really far. So first what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how it shoots and now I'm going to make it for you guys. So there you go guys, uh, that's the cannon. I'm going to show you guys how to make it now, so stay tuned. Alright guys, welcome back. So now I'm going to be showing you how to make the TNT cannon. There are a couple things you'll need to make this. You will need a block of your choice. Right now for this tutorial, I'm using a golden block. You will need TNT, as I have in my hand right now, a bucket of water, redstone, uh, any kind of slab, any slab works for this tutorial, I'm using stone slab, and then you're going to need four levers. Alright, so now let's make the base of it. Alright. So you want to have a big enough square, uh, like right here, I'm making it up on a little balcony. So then it's going to be a 6 by 3 but kind of thing, okay? So what you want to do is you want to place this one block down right here, then go diagonal from it, and then place another block. Now you want to go 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, now for this, wherever you put your stone slab, on one side you always want to have one extra uh, block there, uh, and you'll see why uh, later on in the video. Okay, so now over here, so the way I think about it, it's a six by it's a six by six, uh, just slanted kind of thing. So now we want to go one, two, three, four, five, six. This side should be even with the block that you started on. Uh, then right here is where you're gonna be controlling the levers, and so you can see the TNT and everything. Okay. So now what you want to do is you want to go one up, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. You want to leave this block empty right here. If you do not leave that empty, it will not work. Alright. So now what you want to do is you want to come back to your first block and place another block right there. The water is going to go underneath here. Okay. So now you basically have the base of your cannon already set up. It didn't even take that long. Alright. So now to set up the redstone. Alright. You might need around 20 redstone just to be safe. Okay. So what you want to do is you want to take... Uh, your redstone. Hold up, let me. There we go. That's better. You want to take your redstone, and you want to go from this corner one, two. Do not fill up this corner. That's where your lever is going to go. Then you want to go over here. Go down one, two. Basically, they're going to be this on the same block across from each other. Okay. Now, all right. So this is what this block is for. You put the uh, redstone right there, and on top of it. Make sure you leave this spot right here blank. Okay. A lot of people think uh, they have to fill that in with redstone that it's broken. No, leave that blank. It's supposed to be there. All right, now this redstone is going to go all the way around to the back of the cannon to right there, okay? Now you're, you're going to want to take your lever, put it down on that block. Now you're going to take the other lever and put it on that corner that I showed you earlier, okay? You're going to flip your switches, make sure they work uh, all the way through, okay? Now one thing I noticed, uh, TNT moves when you hit it, okay? And so the reason you get the stone slabs is to put them here, okay? This stops the TNT from moving, they just fall straight down, and so it's not going to mess up your cannon. And to get these in the air like I have them, you put the redstone down first, and then you try to put the stone slab on the redstone, and then it will automatically move it into position that you want. Alright, so basically there you go guys, you have your cannon, now I'm going to show you that it works. So to load this thing, uh, you're going to put two on the bottom. Make sure you do not put TNT under this block. If you do, your cannon's not going to work. You're just going to blow up and die. All right, so two on the bottom, two on the top. Leave this spot right here in front of the stone slab. Leave that blank. Don't put anything there. Then put that TNT right there, okay? You're going to come back around. All right, so what you want to do is come up around here. All right. So to get this to work, what you want to do, let me turn off these, what you want to do is you want to hit the top switch first, okay? Hit the top lever, and now you want to hit the bottom one. And then it should show the TNT flying. So there you go, guys. Uh, this is a really nice TNT cannon. Uh, it looks really good, it works really good, and it's really powerful. Uh, I'm pretty sure you guys can find some ways to use a cannon like this. So thanks for watching, guys. Please rate and subscribe, and let me know what you guys think. Thanks.